New at noon, police confirm one man is dead and they believe he was murdered. Investigators are now still searching the scene for clues. Jonah Kaplan reports. We're here on Nicholson Avenue in Cudahy. It's actually one of the major thoroughfares through the neighborhoods. We've seen a lot of buses, a lot of cars. But today, police actually blocked off this area for several hours. And the only traffic they allowed was pedestrians, moms and dads, walking their kids to school. This neighborhood is used to noise. The residents live in the shadows of Mitchell Airport. Sirens, however, sound much different than jets. I've been in this in Cudahy probably 12 years. No, nope, nothing like this at all. It's, it's really scary right now. Police arrived just before 5 a.m. Investigators confirm someone found a man's body outside an apartment complex on Adams Court. An elementary school is only a block away. It's scary. It's very scary. It's like, I don't know what to tell them. They're gonna, I, mean, I know after school they're gonna be asking all kinds of questions. Detectives have a lot of questions too, starting with who was left to die here and where did he come from? The police chief confirms this was not a natural death. The man was found deceased. The matter is being investigated as a homicide. Officers could be seen searching through the woods and nearby properties, but they say there's no threat to the neighborhood. If you see something out of place, you see something suspicious, as always, call the Cudahy Police Department and report that activity. The police chief added that this is actually the first confirmed homicide investigation here in the city of Cudahy in at least two years. In Cudahy, Jonah Kaplan, today's TMJ4. The medical examiner was called late this morning. State Patrol investigators are also coming in to help. Well, we've got 